Hello everyone. How you guys doing? That's good. That's good. Well, I'm back again with another video. And looks like I'm putting in more work for the crafting community because I have made me some bunny peaks. These are my little peaks, my little bunnies, my little babies. And I put them in the frames that I were, that um, I were, that my um, yarny babies were in. This is just a temporary home for my homemade bunny pictures. I made these yesterday, you guys. So expect that I am going to get more frames to keep them in so that I can display them yearly during Easter. This one is um, my yarny babies. I got to take care of them. I love my yarny babies. But this particular bunny right here, let me show you guys three. I made three bunnies. Yellow, the brown one, and a pink one. If it's glare, I am so sorry. But anyway, guys, the pink one and the yellow one, they're made from chopped up yarn. And they have like that trim on there is um just to give the illusion of a leg. And their little bunny tails are made from yarn all of them have tails made from yarn so i'm trying to see if i can get the picture of all of them but it's difficult at this angle Ooh, me and my photography <laughs> but i'm not an expert i'm just on youtube having fun i'm a i'm a regular housewife just doing stuff Having fun. So I had fun yesterday making these babies. I adore them. They are going to be in my life every year. <laughs> I set out for Easter is my point. That's what I'm trying to make. But I think to me they are so freaking adorable. I love them. And yes, they will be having, they will have their own home because these framed houses belong to the Yarny Babies. They are just borrowing them so that I could display them to let you guys see how they would look in a frame, which that's where they're going to live inside frames. So, yes, I have the pink one. Just call her pink. You can see that. And then brown. <laughs> call him brown or Mr. Brown. Mrs. Pink. Mr. Brown, <laughs> with his light, with his white playful nose and his big adorable smile, welcoming you all into his world. Yes, I created them. They are my new babies. They're just like my yarny babies, except for this one, is made from material. And the yellow one, just call her Mrs. Mrs. Um, bright, bright yellow. This is bright yellow. Yellow Peak. Well, I'll just go with Yellow Peak, the name of the babies for now. But, yeah, they all are so cute and adorable to me. These are my new babies, like my yarny babies. These are my yarny bunnies. And welcome, yarny babies, y'all, just like Mr. Pumpkin and the yarny baby, yarny babies that I made a few years ago. Welcome my beautiful yarny babies. Y'all welcome my yarny babies because they're going to be around for a while. And what else did I want to tell you guys? I want to say that, um, excuse the glare on this um, camera, but that's not what I'm trying to say to y'all. Um, what am I trying to say? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. About the materials that I use. I had one of those books. I forgot what you guys call it. Um... Yes, I'm crafting, but no, I don't know all the names of the, mater the materials or the tools that are being used in crafting. 
but that's okay because I get the job done. But anyway, the materials that I have used, I used the paper from that paper pad book I bought. I think I got it online. And I made a pattern. I made this pattern. I cut out a bunny and I just thought about what I wanted to do with that bunny. I used glue now. I got glue. I have used glue material for this one and then the rest of them they're just yarn and then their eye I used some buttons that I got from that Japanese dollar store Daiso I think it's called those are buttons that I made their eyes with and you know the button that you place the material around and you clasp it together then I just put that little dot on there and their mouths they're all made from yarn so yep yeah. So these are my little yarn, I mean yarn, yarny um material bunny peaks. Pink peak, brown peak, yellow peak. I love them and I hope you guys do too. Well, I don't know what kind of um uh thumbnail I'm going to get out here, but I hope I get one of these bunnies to um display. Yes, I'm still average. Like somebody said in another video, people that don't have trailers or edit their videos, they just throw stuff. I started to say S-H-I-T, but excuse me. I rebuked that word. But anyway, I have thrown up together, I have thrown together a video to display my yarny babies. Yes, I'm rattling on, because maybe I might feel like rattling on this morning, but... I am so delighted with my yarny bunnies. I think they turn out really cute. And when they have their new homes, I'm sure they will be happy and I will too. Well, that's it. That's all, you guys. I just want to come in here and share my little putting in craft, putting in work for the crafting community again. And just let you guys see my little bunnies that I made yesterday. That's why I wasn't on watching videos. Watching you guys' videos, rather. Well, take care, y'all. Have a great day. And I'll talk to y'all later. Remember, uh-oh. I wish I would drop this camera on this glass. That would be a total disaster. Um, I, oh, I have to tell you guys, yes, I support small channels. And I do it at a snail's pace. Thanks again for coming in and watching my videos. Welcome new subscribers. And um, that's about it until I do something else. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Bye.